This video content is not intended for children. Welcome back to Realistic Fishing. I'm at the trout fishing hole, but I'm on the other side of the river. If you look at this parking lot, you can easily see why I don't fish this side. There's 11 cars over here. Now I'm gonna head to that side. I bet there's two or three, and that's why I fish over there. This side is really, really crowded. I don't think the fishing's very fun when you're standing next to people. So that's why we're gonna head to the other side and see if we can get a few. So yeah, this is more like it. Check it out, we got two cars over here, plus me. Let's get down here and start fishing. There's a couple people over here on the dam. Of course, they looked over at me as I walked into the fishing area. If you watch some of my earlier trout fishing videos, all of this is underwater. But right now I can walk out this far. I see a couple of guys out there waiting. Some more on the rocks over there. Let's go check my favorite spots. Hopefully there's no one in them. Here's one of the spots I typically stop at, but we're gonna walk right past it. You know, since there's not so much current through here, I think I'm just gonna skip this spot. Maybe I'll come back to it on the way back. Half of the fun of fishing here is walking through these trails and through the woods. It's kind of like a, a fantasy movie with all the rocks and the trees and shells and all sorts of crazy stuff. It is a very picturesque setting, that's for sure as I step over all the downed trees and logs. This is definitely one of the nicer spots to come fishing for trout. Up there is my secret behind the logs spot. So yeah, if I was 10, I would walk across this log. But since I'm not, I gotta climb over very carefully. I do not want the whole thing to topple over on me. I mean, these things move just a little bit, so you gotta be careful. There we go. 42 year old guy climbing around down stuff. That's all right though, I made it to my spot. Let's get baited up and see if we can get a bite. Today I've got night crawlers. I've been using these same night crawlers for about a month. And power bait turbo. We're gonna start with the power bait. See if we can get a few fish on this. Then we'll put it up against the night crawlers and see which one seems to do better. Yes. Yes. Okay, let me see. Keep it realistic. There's a bite, I think. They let go. They may have stole the bait. I don't know if that was a bite or I got snagged for a moment, but it felt like a bite. Oh man, we got this guy coming in close on me over here. He better not walk through here because that would be super rude. Tried to get away from everyone and they're on top of me already. Well, after about four or five casts, my power bait dough has come off. Let's try the worm instead.
All right, well, I'm going back this way since that guy is basically standing in my way. What a I hiked through here to get to a spot where there was no one. The guy literally walked up and stood right where I was casting. We got all this water here. He could be anywhere, but no. This is Jersey Joel from Jersey Joel Fishing. You're watching Realistic Fishing. Keep it realistic. Mmm, that almost makes me want to leave. All right, let's try over here. Incense burger down there walked right through my spot. He probably scared all the trout, so... It'll be a while before I go back to that little spot. Fingers crossed I can catch one over here in the slow moving water. I'm doubtful, but hopeful. Fishing confidence right now, two out of 10. Yeah, I'm thinking I'll hit up Dick's Sporting Goods since I'm in the neighborhood. So here I am at Dick's Sporting Goods. Let's see if they have any good deals inside. All right, I just got out of Dick's Sporting Goods with a few items. Let's go back to the studio and check them out. All right, now that I'm back in the studio, away from any assholes I might encounter in the world, let's check out what I got from DSG and give some away, because I am one of the good guys. So here we go. Let's see what's in here. Looks like they double bagged it. Let's find the receipt, shall we? Today I paid a total of $13.55. So let's see what I got for less than 15 bucks. I think these are all the same price, so I don't need to look over at the receipt very often. Let's just get right into it. First item I got here is a Magnum Christie Critter in blue and black flake. So this is like a brush hog style bait. But since it's Magnum, that means it's huge. Can I open this without tearing the package open? No. Well, I'm going to tear it open just to show you what it looks like. Check it out. This is a Christie Critter, a huge one. It very closely resembles a brush hog. It has that very characteristic creature style shape. Maybe three times the size of a regular brush hog or Christie Critter. Hey, I like this little hanger that they stuck on there. I don't think they all have that, only the ones with the torn package, but that's cool, now I can still hang it up even though it's open. Anyway, it says the hook to use is a 7-aught EWG. I don't even know if I have a 7-aught EWG. Pretty sure I have some 5s and 6s though, so that's probably what I'll go with. So the Yum Christy Critter was marked down to $2.47, but guess what? DSG was running a special. Buy five, get five free of clearance items. So actually, since I bought 10 items, this only cost half that, $1.23. Can you believe that? Magnum Christie Critters, 
7.75 inch, $1.23. Let's see what else we got. Here we have more Yum. This is a Yum 7.5 inch Genie in moss green flake. Can you see the tail in there? It's got like a flat beaver diamond shaped tail. It says the hook to use for this is a 4 aught offset EWG. And reading the back here it says, Proprietary attractant includes a blend of enzymes and natural attractants. So they have their own scent. $2.47 once again, but it was clearance. Buck 23. Vance here from Fishing with Vance. You're watching Realistic Fishing. Keep it realistic. Here's another package of the Magnum Christy Critters. That makes two of them since they were a buck 23. I mean, why not get a couple? Because I want to give some away. You know, when I run into D bag fishermen out there who kind of ruin the experience, I like to turn it around, do something positive, like go lure shopping, and give some away. It just makes me feel better. I like to make someone else's day by giving them free lures. What's not to like about that? Here's another pack of those genies. We got some watermelon red. The other one was moss green flake. I don't know if I said that. Here's another pack of those genies. Right, a buck twenty-three. I had to get a few of them. Here's another pack of that moss green flake. In case you couldn't figure it out already. This whole bag is going to be full of yum baits that I scored for a buck twenty-three. Here's another package of those Magnum Christy Critters. Right? How could I pass it up? Oh my! Another pack of Magnum Christy Critters. This one is in Green Pumpkin Purple Flake. What do we have here? Another package of genies. This one is in old school purple. Got some big soft plastics here to go for those bigger bass. Here's another genie. This one is in cranberry. And last but not least, another package of genie. What color was this? Once again, cranberry. So check this out. I got 10 packs of Yum Magnum soft plastics for $13.55. I mean, check out the receipt. $13.55. Look at all those zeros. I love seeing all those zeros. It means you got them for free. And when I get stuff for free, you get stuff for free. Let's see what we're going to give away here. We're going to do a pack of these Genies and Cranberry. This is the seven and a half inch. We're going to do a pack of these Yum Magnum Christy Critters in black and blue flake. And one more. Let's find a color that we don't have yet. We'll do a package of these Genies in watermelon flake. If you want to win these three packs of Yum Magnum baits, all you got to do is be subscribed, like this video, and leave a comment below, and I'll pick a winner in a future video. This is Slash Gills from the Juggalo Fishing Posse, and you're watching Realistic Fishing. Keep it realistic. You don't need to tag three people. You don't need to share the video. You don't need to jump through any crazy hoops. I just want someone to win these baits, get out there in the springtime, and catch the bass of a lifetime. So there we have it. We have a Yum Magnum giveaway, because some jerk decided to walk right through my fishing spot. And I just didn't want to fish while I was in a bad mood. So I found these great deals. I'm passing the savings on to you. And good luck to everyone who enters. Thanks for watching Realistic Fishing. Keep it realistic.